Okay, am I back? For some reason, OBS crashed. That's not happened in forever. Am I back online? Hopefully. I don't know what happened. Everything seemed to still be working too. It's just I saw a pop-up over there and it says OBS has crashed. Okay. Right, okay, so it did totally go. Alright. Okay, um, sorry about that. So what I was saying, uh, Shadow Fox in the stream said that this episode of the game is currently going on um, alongside the main story, so we know Gladiolus went off on his own. And this is supposedly what's going on, so hopefully, and he said I don't think anything spoils this, so this is what's going on, this is where Gladiolus is gone for now, I guess, so hopefully we won't catch any spoilers. Okay, uh, let's see. So you know there's an ancient eloquent civilization where your OC and Celestia and Luna are from. So yeah, I, I know I've read the uh, journal of the two sisters, and there's supposedly an Alicorn civilization somewhere out there. So yeah. Nothing really load, right? Yeah, okay. What is the only canon? Don't know it to be true. What's the canon? Suffering a humbling defeat at the hands of Ravis, Gladius embarks on a journey of self-discovery. His destination, the Tempering Grounds, where he seeks to undertake a trial of body and mind that has heretofore afforded only a sole survivor. And we weren't defeated by Ravis, we kicked her freaking ass! It wasn't a defeat. Oh, the Alicorn Civilization. I don't know, it's like... Because, I mean, in the, in the, the journal, it's, um, there's a few inconsistencies in the journal. But, yeah. I don't know, and then if you go by the show, you're like, well, Flurry Heart is the only one that's been born in Alicorn for like a very long time. And it's the two sisters have flowing hair and Cadence, so I don't. Well, yeah, because I mean, Cadence, Princess Cadence isn't a born alicorn. She was a pegasus. And, of course, Twilight was a unicorn. And Luna and Celestia are supposed to be the only birth alicorns. I'm stuffed. <clears throat> My compliments to the chef. My pleasure. Did you enjoy your time with the marshal? Mm hmm. Uh, uh, so, uh, what's that thing on your face? This? Yeah, X marks the spot. That's nah, just a scratch. The other guy got off a lot worse. <laughs> worse than looking like some kind of thug? Speaking of which, who was this other guy? <laughs> they call him... The Streak? The Blade Master.
Do I want the combat tutorial? Is it gonna be something different? Might be. In civilization, I have to earn their wings or horn like a coming of age. So, is that like. Does that information come from like anywhere? Like anywhere in like books or anything? Because I haven't read all the books. There's a ton of books. Breaking and blocking as gladiators differ from attacking and defending as noxious. General actions. Insane. Gladius will be vulnerable if he loses. right now. Well, you gotta attack me, guys. Jeez. Oh, I can't just hold it. This is gonna make things difficult. Press Y to perform glaive arts. Lewis has several arts in his repertoire and hired his valor to strong and attack. War! <laughs> I think I got it. So good. About time. What'll it be? Just the water's fine. Thanks. Allow me to ask you once more. Are you sure you're ready to take on the Blade Master? 
I went up against the High Commander and got my ass handed to me. No, we didn't. I didn't stand a chance. And I never will unless I get more power. Then answer my question. Are you ready or not? <laughs> you think I would have called you here if I weren't? So you're ready to face death. <gasps> Gilgamesh awaits challengers in the deepest recesses of those ruins. Of course the Blade Master is Gilgamesh. Years since we uncovered the caves. We've sent countless expeditions, but all of our efforts have afforded us no rewards. And no survivors. Except for you. You undertook the trial, and you made it back alive. Barely. Let's move. Did you tell your friends why you were taking off? Just said it was business. Didn't want him getting all worried about me. <laughs> or knowing your pride took a beating. Season 8 is airing March 24th. But yeah, I know that. That's this weekend. School of Friendship. As well as the last season before Gen 5. Well, no, there's supposed to be season 9. Right? There's season eight. There's gonna be season eight and season nine, and then that's it for Gen Five. All right, I've got this. No turning back now. We could. Whoa. All right. I like the decorations. Holy crap. You need to clean out this cave once in a while. Jesus. Vestiges of our past. Why? To test those determined to become the King's shield and prepare them to inherit the power they pursue. The Blade Master's men have sworn their loyalty both before and beyond the grave, scaring off the unworthy. You may better prepare for disappointment. <laughs> That'll scare easy. <laughs> Pathetic. <laughs> It's over. Man, the change in music. Pathetic. It's all yours, Marshal. Well, don't mind if I do. either, does he? Ah! Break these boxes. <laughs> Destroying all those barrels. Ah! Got class and then all right. Flame, have a good one. Have a good class. go 
is down. Well that. Whoa. Okay. Splash down. Ugh. tries to block a guard breaking foe's attack, his shield will shatter and he'll take damage. worthy of my mantle? I do. I am here to undertake the trial of Gilgamesh. And what is it you hope to glean? Power! power. <laughs> You're gonna give it to me. Infinite power! Is that so? Ah, oh, cheap shot! Can't win without a cheap shot, huh? and his shield who can safeguard their lives. All those unworthy or unwilling to rise to the task meet their end here by my blade. I ain't meeting mine anytime soon. This trial hasn't even begun. If you do not fear death, then go forth with reckless abandon and prove your worth. <sighs> You are ready for this. In that case, let the trials begin. So the Blade Master, oh, he's a master of blades. What, were you expecting something profound? I was beaten by a one-armed man. <sighs> so you've read the diary of the two sisters and Snake is back. Yes, I've read the Journal of the Two Sisters. I have it. It's on my bookshelf. I had a hard time getting it, too, in this country. And that one arm can switch spots. Giving me 
potions. Rest up while you got the chance. Take a load off. So, what does the journal say exactly? The journal basically <clears throat> it just talks about the uh, kind of ascension of Celestia and Luna because they're actual born Alicorn or they're from an alicorn civilization and pony kind is um they're ruled by you know standard kings and queens and all that but they want to but you know the pony world wants to unite in one big world to be equestria eventually so they're looking for you know something to represent them but at the time you know celestia and luna haven't got their cutie marks yet they're not sure what to do and at the time, also unicorns are actually responsible for raising and lowering the sun and moon. But it takes several of them to do it, and over time they eventually completely burn out their magic entirely. And um, so the journal kind of goes their their process that you know they're they're built they're building their own cat. Uh, well, they eventually have their castle. You know they they start to become rulers. They have a castle and they have a free. And. Um, they eventually earn their cutie marks, which then allows them to control the sun and moon. They find out that, you know, what it was doing to the unicorn, so they eventually, through a slow process, are able to restore the unicorn's magic. So, um, what was it? What else? Oh, and Luna can apparently talk to animals. That's one of her skills. So, yeah, it, it's basically that. So yeah, before the alicorns took care of the skies, it was unicorns. Which you can probably see I've used in um, my storytelling. The Blade Master isn't here to train you. He's here to test you. He won't go easy on you just because you joined the Crown's Guard. So, no mercy for newbies like me. So what, the weak aren't worthy of serving as shield? In his eyes, the weak aren't worthy of living. All of them are fools, punished for aspiring beyond their station. I was a fool back then, too. And I was punished. But you weren't killed. <coughs> Maybe you weren't worthy of serving as shield. But he must have seen you as worthy of living. Maybe he did. Maybe he didn't. That was much more than a soup. <laughs> that was a cup of noodle. What the hell just happened? There you go. Keep your eyes and ears open. Done and done. I don't actually know how to close my ears. Is that a skill anyone has? They always say keep your ears open, but they kind of just.
Why does the map say this leads back to the camp? something in the corners. Your skill is impressive. You may have the strength to defeat the darkness, but do you have the spirit to survive these trials? Well, I mean, so far I'm having fun. Does that, does that count for anything? Take care of that dirt. speculations as to the alicorns. I wonder if we're gonna see any of them before the series ends. Curious. Just don't reform Chrysalis. That's that's my only thing. Don't reform the Queen. Well, for the love of God, don't turn her into a glitter bug, please. Touch. Don't touch. What's this? A trial chamber. The hand holding stops here. Good luck. Wait, we were supposed to hold hands? Did I miss holding hands? And why is that flashlight not in my pocket?
Karte ab. Our power goes with you now, young warrior. Gladiolus is <coughs> completed in the first trial, uh, soul's trials. He can now perform blocks capable of withstanding the mightiest of blows, even those dealt by the blade master himself. Stand tall, for the shield of the king must kneel in subjugation before no man. Thanks for the advice, and for the pick-me-up. So well, basically... you made it out alive. Your first trial may have ended, but many more await you on your road to an audience with the Blade Master. Prepare yourself. So basically, Gladiolus is going to come back and just be a badass. Rest up while you got the chance. Might as well take a break. My father never undertook the trial of Gilgamesh, did he? No. You want to know why? I do. I mean, it can't be because he was scared, right? Not of the trial. He was scared of failing as leader of the Crown's Guard and as shield of the king. He couldn't leave his majesty alone, weakened by the wall as he was. After all, what good is a shield with no one to protect? What about you? Worried about leaving your majesty alone? Well, a little. But I'm gonna do what's right for me, like my father did what was right for him. <sighs> Back to the trials. Never you say his name, keep coming back to the seven deadly sins. I don't know if we'll complete this. I kind of want to only go like halfway through this. Because I feel like maybe... We want to we wanna get to the point where he comes back. And then do this. So we can see kind of what he went through. So we may do the next trial and then... How long has it been since you undertook the trial? 30 years or so? Give or take. I was a lot younger than you are. And far less experienced. Uh, it's a wonder I even made it out alive. This place look familiar to you? Vaguely. The younger me had little mind for taking in the sights. Okay, well... Oh, we go this way. That's what I was supposed to do. Well, you. 
familiar with that. Toy, I'm taking this with me. <laughs> yeah, can you pick that up for me? I can't get it. Chamber, and another chance for the warriors to impart their wisdom. It won't come easy, though. You'll have to earn it. All right, let's do it.
That oven. Oh, there was another column over here. I could have beat him with that thing. and dreams. He cannot perform Maelstrom Glaive art when his valor is hot. Look ahead, for the shield of the king must safeguard our future. Leave it to me. All right, so the next save point, we'll go back to the main quest line, and then when he comes back... The skills shared by these souls have been passed down for generations. The shield of the king would do well to put them to good use. Don't actually get up. Sanctum. Thousands set foot on these grounds, all of them fools, unprepared for the dangers lurking within. They all meet with the same fate, as will you. I don't think so. Think what you may, but I know otherwise. The Lucis you call home is nothing like the Lucis I once served. Your age has forgotten the horrors of war, cobbled by the king and drunk off the complacency of peace. No shield worthy of defending the true king could be born from such depravity. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Look on the bright side. Everyone loves an underdog. Nice to know that the new season there will be different species for the new pony season. Yeah, feels like it's a little bit late on some cases, but better late than never. 
Feed the banner snatch. You got it. Shit, I put it down, I hit the wrong button. Eat when I do that. I cannot get a move in edgewise. They have all got me just clobbered here. Bender snatch down. Will you stand tall? Even when your flesh fails you, or will you fall to your knees? I feel like he's talking a big game, but he's not really, you know. It's not like a save point for a little while, is there? Loves his wall decorations.
saving yet. I really was gonna go back to the main game after this, but <laughs> they're making me do all the. Tell you what, oh, I was gonna say this is a hell of a cave system, but it's not actually. I can actually see sky. Oh, there, oh pff, there's a campground right here. Rest up while you got the chance. Better rest here while I can. All right, we'll go back to the main campaign. So we, we know what he's up to now. We know why he went off. Never thought I'd make my way back to the tempering grounds. You said it's been 30 years. Were you as immortal then as you are now? If you want to know, I'll talk. I do want to know. The Blade Master. What was he like? I don't remember much, except for those eyes. They pierced my heart and peered right into my soul. It was like he knew my every move even before I did. Try as you may, there's no fooling those eyes. <laughs> we'll see about that. All right. <sighs> so let's return to the title and we'll go back to the main campaign. We'll come we'll come back to him when he comes back. I think that'll be a good way of doing it. Go Hall of Fame and Final Trial. How do I? Can't. Turn title. Yes. I do like that though, that they like added in what they do while they're gone. Okie dokie, so back to the main campaign. We just finished gathering fireflies. I remember that much. Cables going every which way here. <clears throat> so we, what was it? We were in one of those kind of dungeon areas where we, uh, we did the mission where we got the fireflies. We got the ruby things that the jeweler reporter guy wanted, and we got one of the weapons from one of the kings. And that kind of that, that kind of forest thicket, whatever it is. It's kind of where we've gotten. Oh. Alright. <laughs> now I gotta remember how to fight on this. And it's not like that fight. I've got Chocobo. Let's go. Alright. 
So, let's see. That's back at Hammerhead. We're not there. Go back to him. Can't do that one yet. Can't do that one yet. Where is she at? She's... Okay, she's there. So we can't really turn that one in yet. I don't think we can do this one yet. That's right. I don't think we can do this one either. Oh, we've got it. Chocobo, colored them blue and called them Glacier. Nice. You all right? I suppose I was. Who are you? And what did you do with Iggy? Don't say what you did with Iggy. Thanks for the ride. Ah, thanks, buddy.